Away he goes. So pre preparation wasn't very good. But then you do have to pick six, so... I don't know. Do another little quest. Mortar and stone, if we're doing repairs, I guess. Horses for the wagon. That was a quick one. So storage cart should have been first. Huh? I guess we just keep doing quests until I've leveled up. Makes sense. Weapons and armor, uh, horses and traps, and bait. I don't know what else we might need for monster hunting. A storage cart to wheel them back. Why not? I don't know if that's work like that but we'll find out
yeah, yeah, it kind of worked, look. Maybe his traps should have been higher up. Oh, we can level the kingdom up. What does that do? Isabella Dwyer has shown up, and Theo Sweeting has as well. Uh, let's expand. Go making the place look pretty. Oop. Went the wrong way. Never mind. Ah, oh, look at the pretty path. What else can we build? Medical tent. Barracks. Medical tent right next to the tavern. Seems a wise decision. They can get absolutely blitzed in there and then just stumble across for medical attention. Right. Let's see what other quests we have. Oh, we can do epic quests, but I think he needs to heal. Where is he? Oh, do I heal him? Oh. You want some pain rides? <laughs> um, you want a forty gold increase? Oh, sure. Why not, Chris? Go and heal though. How do you heal? Is that how you do it? Oh, all these adventures! Are they? I think all of these are adventures coming to town. Oh, you can zoom in, okay. Well, 
Once Chris is healed, we'll, uh, we'll send him out. There's a lot of unhappy people going on. What are these all unhappy? Because there's no shopping, no food. Oh. Oh, uh, the attractiveness rating has dropped, so... Let's just, uh... Build a little well. We'll have the well right there. <coughs> and now let's send Chris on a journey to dive into the ocean. This is not going to end very well. Ah, bait in case any fishes turn up. In fact, I don't think any of these supplies are going to be very good for diving. Let's take some horses with us. I... Traps. Storage carts to bring the fish. But I don't know. None of them seem very worthwhile. And away Chris goes. Everything is awesome. Good. Good. So all these adventurers are just coming to this place to drink beer. Fair enough. Bring your money. And then they leave unhappy. That's weird. So they, they they get absolutely mortal and then they leave unhappy. Oh, we're only the second greatest kingdom, but we are the most popular and the most amused, apparently. Good. Ah, oh, horrible spell. So dead bodies have turned up. Oh, the storage cart was needed for the diving quest. Fair enough. Darling, and that's a. That's actually quite near where I live anyway, I didn't know that was there. Okay, so we've done four quests, we need to do one more to complete the starting objective. Um, I guess that's going to be the epic quest, because, oh no, wait! I can do that one again. Yeah, what was what did I use last time? Okay, so Peter's uh, was right. Oh wait, no. Oh yeah, undo all this. Okay, Peter's books, storage carts, horses, traps. Um, a bit. I'm still trying to work out which one's the best thing to use. Maybe if I read the mission or quest descriptions, I'd get a clue. Sorry about that. Full of cold. It's quite a relaxing game. Okay, so papers again was the only one worth having. So all these ones weren't really needed for that quest. Papers is needed, but it's not in the right slot. Now I'm not entirely sure how you tell which slot it's supposed to go into, so I guess that's trial and error.
Oh, Lurkwood does not like the Mythics quest. There we go, we have done the opening requests. And we've already already placed a decoration, that was the well. And we've already got a tavern. So we need to earn 1,000 gold from adventurers coming in. Oh, Chris the uh, Courageous is bored. I don't know if I've got any exciting buildings for him to do. We'll place a notice board on the entrance there. And we'll level up the kingdom. That might have given us some new buildings, hopefully. Oh, yes it has. So we got a sandwich shop, a weapon store, a theater. Which is for entertainment, aha. Oh, it's massive, hang on. So we might need to expand the kingdom. Uh, we'll expand it this way because there's more terrain. And then, uh, you see, I don't have much money now actually when I look at that. I would leave this with 75 gold, which isn't going to be too good. On the other hand, a sandwich shop it seems worthwhile. I will put that next to the pub as well. And then just for my own amusement, we'll put in the cobbled paths. Well, as um, oh, stocks, <laughs> cool. As well as a flag post to let everybody know you've entered Lucha Kingdom. Oh! Okay, so you can level up your buildings, which I didn't know. And how do you do that? Is it this button? Aha! So, stock quality, better beer. Upgrade stock price, that could be useful for that. Stock limit. What was the maintenance price? Oh, the. We'll increase the stock price, which should help us earn more money. I hope. Chris the Courageous is still bored out of his gourd over there, look. He's feeling a bit lonely as well. He needs more heroes just to come and keep him company. Let's send him on a quest. Uh, repair quest. Now last time I did this, the storage cart was the only correct thing I had selected. So, we'll go with storage cart. Horses for the storage cart. I, I, I thought stone and mortar would work. You know, you're repairing something, you're going to need stone and mortar. Uh, we'll take some bait, just, just for a laugh. And farming equipment. And there you go, Chris the Courageous, out on another quest. <coughs> so many. Are they all queuing up? Is that what that symbol means? I don't know what that means. In a queue. Oh, so they're queuing to get into the pub? <laughs> Good. Q 
queuing up to get into the sandwich shop as well. Popular. Popular business. The Great Depression, oh no. So happiness is going to take a big hit. I think the game ends when all your kingdoms are unhappy. And the happiness is at 25%. So we gained two. Oh, we gained four happiness. What's this? I think that's how many people have joined your settlements. We're doing all right. People are leaving unhappy though. They're fed up of waiting in the queue. We're too popular. We've nearly got all that gold. What else can I build? Oh! There's some, uh, a balloon store! <laughs> cool. Marketplace. And a library. Fortunately, I do not have enough money, so I'll have to wait. In fact, I don't have much money at all to build anything. Nearly made a thousand gold from the adventurers turning up. Counterfeit gold? Ugh. Has gold been devalued? Okay, so we've completed that. Those objectives. Uh, two heroes, epic quest, and unlock a new supply. Alright, two heroes is pretty easy. You just build a new hero's quarters, which I will hide. Oh no, you know what? We'll have it there. Chris the Courageous can have a neighbor. And now we need to hire a new hero. And our new hero will be... Amy the Awesome. What a great name. Oh, you can train them up. I don't know what good that does, but never mind. Okay, let's do an epic quest. Chris the Courageous and Amy the Awesome. And we will do it normally. We have to start with a tame quest. A tame epic quest. Sounds a bit weird having a tame epic quest. Okay, your heroes. Wait a minute. Your heroes haven't encountered a giant wall. It seems to go for miles in both directions, but no visible entrance. Let's find another way. Was that a failure? Oh, we've got to roll the dice. Uh-oh. 
Oh dear. Does that mean we failed? Uh it means we failed. Popularity spike. While on a quest very recently, one of your heroes spoke to a journalist for a nearby settlement's weekly newsletters. As it turns out, this was one of the most popular newsletters across the land and actually made its way into other settlements. Your hero gave such a glowing review of the kingdom that adventurers are extremely excited to visit. Expect an increase in traffic until the next newsletter arrives. Oh no, we're not ready! People are already queuing up for the sandwiches and the beer. Oh dear. Aha! Okay, so we've completed the epic quest. And we have a supply. And a map! Ooh! How do I use the map? Ah, it was junk. Okay, you have discovered the settlement of Smarking Dupe. In order to claim Smarking Dupe as part of your kingdom and start earning followers from them, you'll need to send a hero to negotiate with them and convince Smarking Dupe to join you. Okay. Let's do that. How do I do that? No. Uh, how do I go and claim smoking dupe? Aha! We will send Chris the Courageous. And away he goes. In the meantime, uh, where are the third best kingdom now? But we are the most popular. And the most abused. Let's build a. Uh, I don't know. How about. What? I guess we're going to build a library. Okay, so you can only flip them that way or the other. Place it right on that corner. Can I move this? Or is that stuck there? I think that's stuck there. Okay, so charismatic heroes claim the settlement faster. I'll remember that for next time. So I can research now. Oh yeah, let's let's lower the maintenance. That's gonna take seventy days. Upgrade a settlement. Is this leveling up or am I just clicking buttons and nothing's happening? I don't know. Oh, I don't have enough gold, is that what it's saying? Okay. Uh, while we wait for Chris the Courageous to claim that kingdom, let's send Hang on, I did this last time. Weapons and horses are in the right place. And we'll send Amy the Awesome. She can go about her business normally.
What else can I build while we wait? Medical tent, tavern, barracks, no. Sandwich shop, no, 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 no. Marketplace. I don't think I can build a marketplace. Nope. No, I'm sort of just lacking money. I need to make more money. I'll build some decorations though, because people are saying this place looks ugly. And we'll have, uh, oh, well, you know what? We'll have some barrels. Uh, we'll have some barrels over there. Because barrels are attractive, I guess. I don't know. It's a bit of a weird thing. So we're earning a lot of followers each month. Oh, cool, we've done a... Wow, that was quick. What else should we do? Oh, attractiveness takes longer to decay. That could be a good one. Um, hey, let's double our inventory space. Okay, so traps is the correct one. I'm going to put traps into number two next time. Good, most people enjoy them ones. That's good. And just a bit of money as well. And Chris the Courageous has claimed smarking dupe. Oh, Amy wants more money? I guess we'll give her some more money. How do you upgrade settlements, though? I don't know. Oh, sandwich shop can be upgraded. We'll make them the best sandwiches in the realm. Ah, more counterfeit gold, those bloody pirates. Oh, we have no... Ah, so you can send your heroes to bed. <laughs> that gets their fatigue down, okay. Is that one Amy in the corner? I can't tell. Yes. But she is fine. Let's send her out on another mission. Can she go on a solo? No. The storage cart was needed. Uh, junk, bait, gemstones, mortar, stone. Guessing, guessing, guessing. And there goes Amy the Courageous.
I guess he's deserved and earned his rest. He's been here since the start. He's done this for three years. Okay, so storage cart does go first in the diving quest. And Amy the Awesome's amazing at diving now. Why not? Okay, cool, everyone's pretty happy. Amy's still pretty f no, we'll send her and, and uh, we'll send her to the medical bay. Medical bay? What is this? Star Trek? Medical tent. And our heroes can have a little rest. I'm not sure how you upgrade a settlement though. Cause that's your kingdom going up. Oh no, I've unlocked villains? Is that something I want to unlock? I, I don't think that was something we want to unlock. Uh, ah, okay, so you click on the settlement to upgrade them, I see. So how do I up? Ah, uh, so that's what you do, okay. 20 days, 500 gold. Okay. Oh, I can see, okay. Right then, makes sense. When the heroes are healed, I will do that. Or, I could build another hero house, maybe. More hero quarters? Have another hero? High quality hero housing. Wow. Research is coming along nicely. Uh, this would be a good one. Recruci increases hero recovery time. I think we could use that. And then we'll do lowest time needed to research upgrades. There we go, two benches. People can sit down and chat about rubbish. Oh, freak weather! In what can only be described as one of the worst storms this side of the century, a huge number of buildings throughout the kingdom have taken some serious damage. We'll have to put up with heightened maintenance prices for a while. Uh, okay. Alright, then let's um, go and up 
upgrade this one. Or send Chris the Courageous. Oh, wait, no. So, he should be away now to. Yep, good. Upgrade a settlement. And while we wait, we will send Amy the Awesome out on a Mythics quest. Storage cart, papers, books, gemstones, junk, bait, guessing. It seems that an adventurer is spreading slander across the settlements about one of your stores being poorly managed and unsatisfactory. This may have an impact on sales. Damn you, adventurer! Alright, so we're still the most popular, we're still the most amused, we're still the most educated. What? But we're still only third out of all the kingdoms. That's rubbish. I'll not be out in that. Oh, is he upgrading the settlement? No? I don't know if he's done it. He went away and he's came back and nothing's happened. Oh, he's so... Oh, look, he needs, like, entertainment big time. Let's send these two on an epic quest. Lower the time needed, and then we will send these two out on a epic quest. Oh, you see, now we can't inspect the runes because we don't have the right conditions, so we've just got to continue. Upon climbing an incredibly steep incline of land, your party stumble across a sprawling series of stone ruins. It is not initially clear what once stood here, but it looks impressive nonetheless. Your heroes continue past the ruins, carry on their quest. Good old heroes, ignoring the ruins. Man, people are still even very unhappy. Cool, now we have... A supply, and a cloak of weakness. Which Amy can wear. Oh, which I can wear. Fair enough. I don't know why you'd want to wear that. But whatever. Alright, is he still he's still what he's sad. He needs entertainment. Plus his social isn't very good. You know what I'm gonna do? Oh, he needs healed, so we'll send him to get healed. And We'll send 
Amy the Awesome to have a rest. And let's see what we have that will... Is, is the theatre the only thing that does entertainment? Give adventurers fun hats. Cool. Uh, let's build a weapon store. And we'll build it... Right there. There we go. Oh, connection bonus? Oh, okay, so if you connect things up with rewards, they get a connection bonus. Oh, that makes sense. Oh, she bought something. Yay! He is so bored of his life. Okay, we need to earn some money so we can build uh, the theater for Chris the Adventurer. Oh, so right click allows you to move things. Uh, did not know. Amy the Awesome is still resting. She's uh, pretty tired. So let's send let's send Chris out on a uh, on a journey by himself. That should earn some money while we wait. And by the time he gets back, hopefully Amy's fully rested, and then we can go on an epic quest! Although I still need to upgrade a settlement. Aha! So I got two things completely correct, and one was slightly in the wrong place. So a storage cart and books are needed for repairs, as is the junk. So we just need to find where the junk needs to go. So these are almost completely happy. And then smirking dupe or smarking dupe. Could do with a little bit more happiness. Right then, let's go and upgrade smarking dupe. Uh 
and we will give Smarking Group a notice board. And we will give Darlington also a notice board. Hopefully, that counts as an upgrade for a settlement. Yes, it did. Good. So now we need to get to Kingdom Level 5, earn 10,000 gold, and build an inn. And that will give us, if we complete all of those objectives, we will get 2,000 gold back. But first, we are going to build a theatre. Because Chris the Courageous looks like he's ready to, to explode. He's been waiting so long for this bloody theatre. Uh, oh, they're just in the way, aren't they? Guess we'll build it here. And he's straight in there, look, he's straight to the theatre, kinda, almost. Uh, the theatre will have... What will it have? I don't know. What will it have? It will have a... St cobbled grass. Keep the theme going. Thing is, I can't tell where the other cobbles are. There we go. Ah, oh, he's finally going to get his entertainment. He's only waited four years for it. How are we still third? We are so lagging behind these other places. But we're still the most popular. Still the most amused. Still the most educated. That's fine with me. Okay. Expendable income. I guess that means we've made a lot of money from the shops. I'm going to build a hero quarters and uh, we'll build it, we'll build it here. I don't know if you need to build roads and connect things up, but from an aesthetics point of view I am. And now we will recruit a, a hero. And we'll bring in... who should we? Mark the Handy! Wow, he's expensive. Scott the Honest. Tara the Bold. Sarah the Sneaky. Michelle the Protector. Teddy the Tough. Darren the Useless? Why would you... Why would you hire Darren the Useless? Bob the Bold. Oh, let's get Bob. No, that's not. It's expensive. Let's get... Teddy the Tough? I don't know, man. Who should we get? Uh, Mary the Magnificent. Ah, oh, Lauren the Lovable. Let's get Lauren. There we go. We have four heroes. Time 
Photo quest. Oh, what's this about? Oh, we can't do that because we haven't unlocked it. Okay. Let's go on an epic quest. And uh, we'll go on a team one because we're taking, uh. We're taking the new. The new lady with us. On the route to their next destination, your heroes are approached by a beggar in the street. He asks for some supplies to keep him alive. Let's give him some supplies. Amy the Awesome rolls a seven. Not too awesome. Lauren the Lovable. She gets three rolls? Wow. Each citizen in your kingdom deserves to be treated equally. So after helping him out of your out your hero spends some time getting to know the beggar who expresses to them that he was once a very important man who fell on hard times. This is the first time since then that anyone has treated him with any form of respect. He then continues to deliver some valuable information about the villain that thwarted him and asks that your heroes do all they can to seek vengeance. So we've gained... So we've healed. Oh, nice, we got some loot. Chris the Courageous is suitably entertained now. That's what we like to see. Um... We can't afford to upgrade anything there. Chris the Courageous needs... He needs some social stuff in his life, but I don't know what, what that would be. That's probably the inn. How much is the inn? I can't even see the inn. Oh, there it is. I need level 6 to buy the inn. Wow. Okay. Got some way to go before that. So we've done the epic quest. Lauren the Lovable. I can see why she's called that now. We got some carpet. Some diamonds. A map. And a map. Um, okay, I think, yeah, the tavern. The, the tavern should get the carpet, maybe. Or the weapon store. Or the sandwich shop. The tavern can have the carpet. Um, I don't think any of these have a high threat level, do they? You have discovered the settlement of Brushward. In order to claim Brushward, yeah, okay, I know that. So we need to send someone to go and claim it. Uh, we've discovered the settlement of Sterling Wood. Well. Oh, yeah, I keep forgetting to do research. Uh, we'll add another book. That'll give us another research. So we can do two research at once. Or research two things at once and uh, we will go and claim oh someone already controls sterling wood the fiends so the higher the charisma that wow lauren the lovable she is like the negotiator she's going to claim this settlement so fast she's just going to turn up and go i'm lauren the lovable 
And everyone will be like, yes, yes you are. We're going to join you now, Lauren. Um, while we do that, we'll do another epic quest. With Chris and Amy. We'll just do it normally. But we will do... A mediocre one. Let's push the board out and do a mediocre one. Let's see how badly this goes. But no, I have I have faith in Chris and Amy to do the right thing here. A defensive stance, a, a sudden flash of lightning wraps and emerges around your heroes. But this was different to ordinary lightning. It repeated swiftly and flashed vibrant colours of the rainbow. Almost as soon as it started, it had stopped. Your heroes look down to their feet at a strange dual track of flames that stretch behind them. <laughs> yeah, we've got to follow the tracks. That Back to the Future reference cannot be ignored. Alright, we've done well there. So all Amy needs to do is roll a 6 or higher. You can do it, Amy! You can do it! Ah, oh, you can't do it. And we can't retry because we don't have the gold. So we failed. Your heroes follow the tracks as far as they can, but as they reach a construction sign for one of the local settlements that's been developed, the tracks just seem to stop. Whatever the tracks were caused by is gone. Oh well. If Lauren the Lovable had been here with her 1200 rolls. Okay, let's never ever go on a quest without Lauren the Lovable again. That charisma. Uh, so we've completed the quest. We got, well, right, we got some good gold, and um, we've twenty-one new residents of the kingdom. Is Lauren back yet? She's nearly done. Okay, so we now have brushwood. Amazing, good stuff. Uh, Amy the Awesome is saying she needs to heal, so I need to try and pick her out from the crowd down here. I don't know if there's a way- is there a way to, to spin the camera? No. No, there's not. Okay, so that's a little annoying that you can't spin the camera, because she's hiding somewhere behind there. Although she's already resting, so that's fine. Kingdom's unhappy. Oh wow, they really are unhappy. Uh, four months before they rebel against us. Why are they unhappy? Brushwood's unhappy. I will send Lauren to build uh, an outpost in Brushwood. And... I guess we need to do some quests, and fast. Do a beast quest. So we go with traps. Then horses, and armor, then that, then that. Oh, 
hopefully this uh, this makes them happy. Then once all the heroes are back, because uh, Lauren the Lovable is a way to upgrade. Oh, we only have three more months to make them happy. Why are they so happy? Unhappy. Let's see if I can boost them with decorations. Maybe that's what they need. I want to have a flower bed somewhere. Is that going to make them happy? No? Ah, they're not easily swayed by random flowers. They're too clever for that. Okay, so that's it. Happiness gained. That's uh, 11 happiness gained. All the happiness is up. So surely that's gonna... Boost them? No? No? Okay. Uh, they're still unhappy. Epic quests. We need to quickly go on an epic quest. Everyone needs to come on this epic quest. We'll do a mediocre one. Because they're all unhappy. I don't know why. Oh, because finances are low? Heroes... Is that what, is that what it's telling me? So total happiness is right down because we don't have enough gold. But everything else is fine? I don't get that. I'm confused by that. Because we have plenty of gold. Ah, we failed! Oh dear, you've made everyone in the land miserable. What a dreadful thing to do. Perhaps it seems that you're a little bit selfish and forgot about the people that... What? No way! Regardless, it appears that this is the end of the road for you as a leader. The people have rebelled and overthrown you. The power you once had over the people in this kingdom has been lost, and your capital has officially been abolished. Your once subservient heroes have now relinquished themselves from you and have left the capital in search of another leader to offer their services to. As for the people, they'll go back to living off the land and will most likely choose to join one of the surrounding kingdoms for support, assuming that the raiders don't get them first, of course. Perhaps next time you should be more thoughtful of your actions and put the needs of the people before your own. But they was having, uh, they had flowers! And now we just get a black screen of death. Oh, great. Is that it? Is that the game broken? I think that's the game broken. It's like you failed. You can sit here staring into darkness. Oh, okay. Well, that's the first dream I've done for a long time. And it seems to have went well. That was a good hour. Uh, thanks for watching, those who watched. I'm going to end the stream now. This is more of a test, just to get back into the swing of things. I will maybe see anyone later. Goodbye.